Okay, we are ready for the next part in the Bernat basic hat. It's actually called the basic cap. I'll show you a picture of it again so you'll remember what it is we're making. Ta da! It is the Bernat Mosaic basic cap. And you'll find the free pattern on the Bernat Yarn website, www.bernat.com, and then look for the free ebook called Masterpiece. And that's where it's going to have several patterns that you can make with Bernat Mosaic yarn. And uh, we are making the hat or the basic cap. This is the ladies' version, basic or slouchy. The men's version, basic or slouchy. And each hat only needs one skein of yarn. Bernat Mosaic and it stripes itself. This colors change as you knit with it. So it's a really fun yarn to knit with. You'll enjoy it. So in the first video I showed what materials we need and in the second video I showed you, showed you how to get started casting on. And I have finished casting on all my stitches. I have 84 on my 16 inch circular needle. The smaller needle. And what I'm doing right now is I'm feeling around to make sure that my stitches are not twisted because you don't want to have your stitches twisted before you start joining in the round. So I just feel around and I make sure all of the, the bottom of the stitches is on the inside of the circle. So I just feel around and everything feels right. So now I'm ready to join in the round. And this is how I join in the round. I get the yarn, um, the, the needle with the, the yarn from the ball in my right hand and the other needle in the left hand. And I get what was the last stitch here and bring it over to the right needle. And I get what was the last stitch on the right needle and I carry it across to the left needle. Uh oh, the world fell apart. There. <laughs> My circular needle knocked off the camera. So let me show you that again so you see what I'm doing here. Put that back like it was. So here we are, just like that. Didn't mean to knock you off the counter. I hope you're okay. I didn't hit your head, did I? <laughs> okay. That's the left needle. This is the right needle. And I get the last stitch and I bring it over to this needle. And then I come across here to get the what was the last stitch here. And I bring it across over to the left needle. And so they pass through each other. Just like that. Now they've swapped places. Now the stitch that was on the right needle is on the left needle. And the stitch that was on the left needle is on the right needle. And here is where you need to put your little stitch marker. Just like that. Now we're ready to go in the round. We're going to be knitting around and around and around. And at this point is where we'll be doing ribbing. So let me look at the pattern. It says to knit two, purl two. And then repeat that from all the way around. So you're going to be doing knit two, purl two, over and over and over again. So let me show you how this is going to work. The first stitch is going to be pretty tight because that's the one that you brought over from the right needle. So now pull that yarn. I'm going to knit one. And then you knit the second one. And the first row is always the hardest. So you just have to be patient with that first row. I'm going to move this yarn out of the way to help you see a little bit better about what we're doing with our stitches here. So I knit the first two and now I bring the yarn forward and I'm going to purl two stitches now. So I purl that one. And now I'll purl the next one. And I'm working real slow so you can see what I'm doing. Now you take the yarn back and then you're going to do the same thing over and over again. You're going to knit two and then purl two. So now I'm going to knit two. One. Two. Three. 
And then I bring the yarn forward and I'm going to purl to you. One, two. I always remember to take the yarn back when you're ready to do knit stitches and bring the yarn forward when you want to do purl stitches. So um, that's all there is to it. And I'll see you in the next video when we get to the end of this round so that you'll know what to do. Talk to you later. Bye.